Yeah, hello, this is Dave from Cheapbooks.com, playing World of Tanks. The tank I am playing is the SU-152. It's a Russian Tier 7 tank destroyer, and the map is Redshire. Played this game about a week and a half ago. I love this tank. I absolutely love this tank. Once I started to play with this massive gun that does 700 damage, I really, really, really love this tank. It's so easy to kill tanks, especially if you're in a in a same or lower tier game where enemy tanks have low hit points. Target acquired. Target acquired. Enemy armor is destroyed. So there's an example. It did 741 hit points of damage. Normally you can do that without ammo racking uh, the enemy tank. This is a tank that I hate to get rid of. I'm actually only a few games away, only need a few thousand EXP. And I don't want to give it up, I want to keep the tank. I also love the fact that you can get very close to tanks as long as you get your shot in first. You can one-shot and completely destroy a lot of enemy tanks. They won't even get a chance to fire back at you. And that's the strategy that I'm using. We're immobilized! Track hit! We're immobilized! Obviously, I took a lot of damage, used my repair kits. You can see that I'm not that concerned with capping. I didn't come here to cap. I came here to get close to some enemy tanks so I can blow them out of the water. Like that Comet has 577 hit points. I can one-shot him right now. And of course, same with that T-25. The only problem is you're vulnerable here to snipers. There's a sniping position behind me. And you don't want to be... Um, you, want, you don't want to have your rear pointing in that direction. So it looks like I am heading across... Ready to fire! ...to where the, uh, the herd is. Difficult to shoot through the houses. Especially with how far he is. Missed a chance right there. Target lost! Very dangerous to do what I'm doing. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Lucky shot didn't aim all the way. Ready to fire! I don't see the target! Got three kills. Narrowly missed a shot. Permission to engage. Got him. We're dead for. Everyone get out. So that was four kills. The score is ten to seven. Um it shows you the power of the gun. I'm I'm playing it this with a new strategy, and the new strategy is not to be a sniper, but to get close to the enemy 
where the gun accuracy is increased and try to get that first shot in so that it absolutely kills him and there can be no return shot. And obviously on a map like this, you've got this open area, and I was in the open area trying to chase down targets. Uh, there are four tanks on the enemy team, which means that I missed a few more opportunities for um, getting some more kills in and some more damage. This is absolutely a tank that is a monster on the battlefield, and it's so easy to get four kills. Um, if if I have another game where I get eight or nine or ten kills, this is the type of tank to do it in, uh, as long as, of course, it's a little bit faster. That's one of the big shortcomings is its speed uh, prevents you from getting to where you need to be in order to put in those final kill shots. Okay, so that's the SU-152. Uh, this is a Russian Tier 7 tank destroyer. The map is Redshire. Uh, if you want to join my clan, you are welcome to apply at CBKS. And we have a lower tier clan, which is CBKS2, and a clan for SPG players, which is CBSPG. If you have any questions or comments, please post below.